Hello and welcome back to the tutorial brought to you by my productions. I'm Mohammed and today I will be showing you how to make your own personalized blog on screen background for Windows 7. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. First of all, begin by right clicking and click on screen resolution. And you want to keep these numbers in mind. Uh, go ahead and open up Photoshop or any other image editing software. Click on File, New, and I'm going to select Pixels and 1, 3. 6-6 six, six, I think mine was, um, yep, yeah. and 768, 768, and we're going to call this log on screen background, click OK. Now when you've got this, just go on Google and grab an image for yourself, or you can make your own um, to set as your background. Uh, I would recommend that you keep this middle keep in mind that this is where the logon things logon image and password username section is going to be right about here now the image I'm going to use is on my desktop so I'm going to click on place and windows logon changer and I'm going to use this one fits perfectly and this is the one I created earlier myself so we're not going to be using these and I'm just going to go ahead and save this so when you're done with the image just go ahead and click on file save as um, you can change it you can save it as however you want I'm going to change it as log on screen bg save and click ok after saving just go ahead and minimize uh, photoshop click on windows log on changer and in here you will find this now this program is in the link down in the description down below make sure you right click and run it as an administrator when it pops up um, all you have to do is you just have to click on the blank space and it will tell you to search for the image and then all you do is you just go ahead and navigate to the folder where your image is in mine's in here click and click open and the good thing about this program is that it automatically um, changes the I was going to say resizes it if the resolution is too big so it changes it to JPEG, JPEG automatically click OK and let's go ahead and check out our new logon background let's just click on lock and there we go now you can see the mine's a little bit out of uh, out of place. If you just move the top down a bit, you will have to work with alignment a little bit. And that's it. That's how you make your own personalized log on Windows 7 uh, background. Uh, I hope you have fun with it. You can inbox me some of your creative uh, backgrounds if you have if you do decide to make your own personalized one. And I'd love to see them. Uh, other than that, don't forget to comment, rate and subscribe to my channel so you can keep up to date with some more good tutorials and I'll see you guys in the next tutorial.